in today's episode of Into the Radius. Oh my god. There he drops, sack of potato style, to the powerful round of the Mosin. Episode 13. Okay, so let's attempt at the next security level, I guess. And we might drop off the pistol. We might have to leave it here. Even though, you know, it's quite good at, you know, just in case we need it, but... I think we're going to be too heavy if we're going to take the Mosin as well. So yeah, let's um, look for a bit of a space. Just wondering where we can put it. It's so full. Okay, we'll just kind of put it there. But yeah, we're going to, if we don't, if we take the pistol with us, I believe we'll be too heavy, to be honest. Of our kind of, so 17, 19... And these mags aren't full, by the way, so, you know. So, you know, 17 to, from like 16 to 19. It's as much as, like, the Mosin would take. Well, we'll try holding the Mosin as well. 24 with the AK. Okay, we might be able to take it, but we will definitely overload, I guess. So, let's see. Okay, we can definitely just clean this up. And we have to leave it on the back. So yeah, I don't know. Maybe maybe we will take What's the, the ammo though. Maybe we should take the pistol, but don't bring much ammo for it. Maybe we'll try that, I guess. And we want to. Well, we'll fix it up first. We'll fix this first. And then we're. And then we'll look at upgrading it and getting a scope for it. Okay, there's quite a lot of juice on it. I guess we just need to scrub the juicy bits then. Seems to work a lot better then. You just gotta know where to scrub, I guess, then. After all this time, I'm still trying to like work out how to What's the best way to scrub it, I guess? Let's try and get it right on the rust. I mean, it should be very close to cleaning, I guess. Okay, try that. Okay, that was perfect. Okay, we're clean the, the butt normally. Seems like a good place to clean. But how much damage does... Okay, it does about... About two, two and a half times damage of the AK. AK rounds. And then we're still going to need about a good 60 to 90 bullets for it. That's what I was hoping for anyway. Just uh You know, make sure we've got enough to finish off the guys. With. Okay. I'm trying to... So that don't really seem to... Okay, just here, maybe. Maybe we should clean the... The end of it. Okay, we're getting somewhat... Okay, let's switch sides. Perfect. It's gonna it's gonna be very close now. It must be. Must be like just just about ready to turn blue. I guess. Okay. 
come on. Has it got a lot of dura Yeah, it's got quite a lot of reliability. Okay, there we go. It's blue. Okay, let's get this um, rotted. And let's go see what upgrades it's got once we do this. It's got quite a long barrel, it, feel it seems like. The rod kind of goes all the way into it. But yeah, okay, we got the, the bullet thing for the extra armor. It's looking very shiny from all the cleaning, I guess. How's the AK doing? So yeah, 24. So did that weigh anything? Okay, it weighs quite a lot. Never mind. It weighs loads. So it weighs literally like 6 kg. Pistol. 2 kg. And then we need all the ammo. And another grenade. How's the body armor doing? Could do with a, a repairing since we're going to be deep again. Has a polygonal. Okay, that's probably good enough. Maybe, maybe bring a brand new one. But yeah, let's um go and probably bring a, you know an extra can or two of food. And um, we're probably gonna reset the tide. So once the tide's reset. A new polygon and all. And now just the ammo, I guess. So, five. I think it's five. Let's see. Okay, it's not the five one. Five four. Okay, it's five four. So, five four ammo. See how much they are. CHP. I don't know what CHP is. Like what type of ammo that's going to be. But let's read them. Sniper rifle contains 20. So I guess that's just the standard ammo. Low quality. So this is actually worse. This one is literally worse. The low quality ammo in the middle. And piercing, armor piercing here. And the way he loads, the way um, half a kg, half a kg each, so, you know, that's going to obviously add up. How much money we got? 4,000, so, let's get a few, let's get one more. Half of our money gone, I guess, in one. Okay, this is going to be a bit hard to load, I guess, because it's like... You have to load it manually, kind of thing, I guess. So we're gonna have to put the bullets in like that and then load them manually. Still got to think what to do with the pistol if we're gonna take it or not with the extra weight. Um, so that's um, one box opened. We'll load it up right now. Okay, that's quite awkward the way that is it's like on the other side but yeah maybe they need to make like a new bag so we can um so we can you know hold a bit more stuff because with two guns you know we're already over overloaded with stuff i was hoping to get a suppressor for this and um any, you know, a scope, both, but I don't really think we're going to be able to afford it. Now it's just wondering how it loads. So do we just load it from the top? I might get rid of this ammo. It might be the lower quality one, I'm guessing. Let's have a look at it there. So armor piercings through the roof. Armour piercing's the top with this one. 
yeah okay these are quad AP rounds AP, AP rounds so let's um get them all out okay you just load it straight from the top after pulling the bolt it looks like okay that's it should be fully loaded and I don't think you can chamber one because it's already like chambered it'll fly out if you thing it so yeah that's that done and we're going to need, we could do with some more money so after we sleep we might do this mission. If, if it's still there. So let's bring some food. And we'll bring the ammo actually as well. Start getting them out. I might just, I might just, okay, let's start to drop out the inventory. Okay, just four to get, I guess. Okay. So yeah, um, we want to see if that shard, if we can do that shard mission as well. So these, check if they're full, 30, 30, 30, and the one in the AK, and 30. I'm pretty sure we loaded this as well. Okay, I don't think it's loaded for some reason, I'm pretty sure it was loaded. We must have biasly shot it, maybe. It won't let me load another one, so I'm guessing it's already loaded. It's just not showing us for some reason. I want to check how damaged it is as well. Um, put it in this hand. Okay, yeah, it's got one in the chamber. And it's um, full health. So we're good on that. And then we've got these 47 rounds. And we got these four mags. And then I'm just wondering how we're gonna do this uh, mission because we, when we when the tide comes in, we're gonna um, decide decide how to decide how to get the mission done. If we're gonna shoot off um, AK rounds or or not, basically. Let's have a look at. Okay, so you can get like some sort of like barrel attachment. I'm guessing that's there for the silencer actually. Now I'm thinking about it. Replace base sight with rail B. So what's it got on it at the moment? Yeah, it's got the PU, the PU scope mount. Which I think is like the only thing we can get anyway. And then what's the rail... So you can get rail B attachments on it, I guess. So the PU scope. Under this one. And I'm not sure how good it is, but... We just, I guess we just got to hope it's a good one. There's also all the scopes, but... Let's get that. Okay. There we go. And let's see how good these scopes are. Okay. Can we do anything to it? Okay. Yeah, it, it kind of just seems no zoom. But yeah, we should hopefully do well with it. 
let's hope. And I guess we'll take the pistol for the thingy mission. Uh, I guess we can just use that. We can get some practice with the Mosin actually. On the way. On the way there. And then that's us down a few, a little bit. Let's see. Yeah, I'm sure it was 2 kg, wasn't it? Yeah, 2 kg. So, you know, a bit more, you know, probably about 3 kg on the pistol. Okay, let's have a. Okay, just work clean the AK. Keep it in, you know, good condition. I think you actually move slow with two guns as well. Seems like we're. I don't know, I can't tell, but, you know, kind of seems like we might be moving a bit slower, kind of thing. Or it felt like it, anyway. Okay, brilliant. And then just a... Uh, just a barrel. Okay, that's it done. I think this this mag is the only one that's suffering at the moment. Slight, slight wear and tear. Okay, where's that um toothbrush gun? So yeah, we've basically got a big mission to do today. Um, and then next security level, and we've got to go to that village. I'll have to show you on the map in a bit. But the the village was looking quite big, so we're probably gonna have a lot of guys to shoot at. Hopefully, sixty rounds is en is enough. In the Mosin, with you know, with this, with the three mugs that we've got loaded here. And I think one needs to go in the gun. There we go. And oh yeah, wanted to repair the armor as well. That's the last thing. But yeah, let's get a bit of practicing with the Mosin when we go out. We'll take, I think we took one. We'll take, take that one as well. And I mean, it would be nice to get a silencer. Let's see if we can get a silencer for it as well. But we can't afford it at the moment. But Tiger Rifle, SKS and Mosin. There it is, a thousand. We've got a thousand, but we need to buy the the, the thingy for it. The adapter, I'm pretty sure. Oh, we can even get one for the AK. I didn't know that. It'd be really good for the Mosin, because you know we'll be trying to stay quiet, I guess. So yeah, we may be able to, when we do this mission, we might be able to, and you know, get get a bit of the, the radius treasure, hopefully. Might be able to buy that, and then we'll head off to the next mission, I guess, after that. Um... Let's take take the mission then. Oh, we got missions in the Pekur's castle now. So let's um So how many hours have we got left? I think we we still got one day left. Surprised about that. Okay. I thought it would take longer to get back home. I'm sure we had like a day left. Maybe it was a few hours. But a few hours and a day. But yeah, here's where we got a head to to do that mission. But we'll take the mission. I'm sh pretty sure it's not going to be. Sapitamental. Temporal. Saptem. Saptia temporal anomaly has been detected at a former. Kolka's Zarya. The phenomenon 
is likely to be caused by a hidden artifact. It requires specific, a specific ritual to discover. Okay, interesting. A specific ritual. And I think it says, ex explore the location, search for hints that will lead to the artifact. Damn. So you know we're going to be running around here with the tank driving around. Oh, we've got a, a base there that we can hide in. But yeah, it's going to be a scary mission. And then we've got the thingy to do. I don't know if it's going to end but by the, t the, wipe, the tide wipe. It gives them 2,000, which we're, we're relying on to get that pis the, um, thingy scope. So in progress, this one. It says it's wiped out by the tide, but I don't know. If, I don't know how long they last. We've got one shot, so we just got to hope, you know, that you don't have to do them both in. You don't have to get them both in one wipe. It does say the wiped out by the tide though, but it only shows you one area where it's meant to be. What other mission do we have? What's this mission? Trying to think what mission that is. Unless that's where the other shard is meant to be. Find a special rift and bring it back. Special rift? Never heard about a special rift. I don't know if it's like a, you know, like a, a step up from just the normal rifts. But... Yeah, let's um go sleep then. Well, I don't know. Maybe we could try and if we go back to Bol Bolotiki, maybe we can um try and get a shard from there because we know that there was something at Bolotiki. Now we've got the 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 Mosin. Yeah, let's um let's let's go try that. We've got a day left, so we've got enough time hopefully. Because two thousand, if we get that two thousand, we're probably smashed the goal for. Smash the goal for um, you know, smash the goal for the the silencer. That was it, the silencer and the the, the adapter that we need. I remember that we put them, oh, I looked on, you know, I looked at a recording and I saw them here. So, yeah, we just left them there. But, yeah, let's um, head off. How much do we weigh? 26. Trying to think where old um, rifts can actually be as well. Okay, let's um, turn the the safety off and let's try it okay safety's now should be now off so the next next one should be a shot I guess yeah we've we got to think where the other rifts are really maybe at the down here. Oh, we forgot to repair the armor as well. But yeah, we're definitely gonna have to go back to base to wipe the tide. I guess so. I guess we're good with that. I can't remember if we. I think we did actually. Now thinking about it. But yeah, let's um head head down to the hangars. I can't remember if we've done it this way, but have a quick look down there before heading to Velocity. So we're just, we're just looking for any rifts, I guess, at the moment. Any rifts that are going to give us a broken shard. And I definitely know there's one in Belotiki. 
Well, we 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 de definitely now did definitely hear buzzing on the way there. Okay, there's definitely no buzz in here. Let's head straight to the train station then. Okay, we might better get this way. Oh yeah, just remembered I've got to kind of go into the bag to pull out the Mosin every time. I keep thinking it's on my shoulder, but we can definitely just pull it out. You know, we, you, well, you can't just put it out, you got to pull out the bag first, I guess. So I guess that's the thing to remember. And then no more pistol as well. So we're going to have to be pulling that AK out to save our lives. But 2000, you know. You know, we really need that if we can do this mission. And, you know, try out the Mosin. I guess it's kind of it's kind of sucky that the scope doesn't zoom in more. But, you know, we're, we're make do, I guess. Oh, yeah, and I want to check out that, f that place. Whatever that place is. The hidden place. I don't know where it's going to take us. Okay. Let's take our first shot. Our first ever shot with the Mosin. Okay. This is going to be difficult. Definitely not an easy job to aim. I think the game's got natural wobble as well. Like when you're looking down scopes and stuff, there's there's natural wobble to. Oh my god, that is loud. Wow. So yeah, that's a. Uh, you know, that's um. I guess a bit of how loud it's going to be. A bit of a, a notice and why we probably definitely need that suppressor down the line to get the missions done. So now I'm just, I'm just going to look for any of the enemies we can take out. There's a guy all the way down there I see. Be, be, be behind these trees. Ah, oh, saw him down there. Okay, so I'm just trying to think where we're trying to get. So, like, to that building. These two buildings we need to get to. Okay, there he is. They're going to come ru rushing out like they usually do, I guess. Okay, if we can get a snipe on it. That'll also work. Okay, I think we're getting rushed. I heard some footsteps. Guess I'll just turn off the light. Should be able to get a shot from here. Okay, we got a seeker. Okay, we're definitely going to be detect detected after this shot. 
Okay, I can't. Yeah, he sees us. Okay, we got him. Oh, and we... Ah, oh, damn. That's going to waste some time. Damn, we walked at the map. Don't know where it's going to take us. Okay, it didn't take us too far, but we're right in the black stuff. Let's get back to where we were. There's that place again where we definitely want to get to in a bit. <sighs> Trying to look out for that seeker. Okay, this of it down there. Okay, it's a fragment. Okay, I'm just wondering where that seeker went. Damn. As well, the scope. It's going to take two shots to kill these guys, I guess. Okay, we've got... Um, everything coming our way. Got no quiet way to dispose of them. Okay, how, many t how much time does that leave? There's 19 hours on the clock. What time is it? 10? Okay. We're very close to it. Might just rush in and rush out. Let's run for it. I mean, we could do a spot of looting here as well, to be honest, but... We do just want the broken shard. Okay, let's run. It's not what we're looking for. Okay, well, no shard there, I guess. I guess we might as well loot what we can. Thinking about going to... Uh, I think it'll take too long. With 19 hours to go. Um, you know, half of it's going to be in the dark, I guess. Okay, I'm just trying to think where else shards may be. There was a shard of Dan up there, Kolkaz as well, in that factory, but it was getting too scary at the time. Getting dark as well. It, I think it like switched, it just went from light to dark in like a second or something. Okay, I don't think they show up in the scope. Guessing everything, anything would be terrified after hearing a shot like that. Okay, yeah, we've got to think what we're going to do if we're going to explore down there or, or something. Um, back to the compound to try and get that shard. The factory, I think the factory is too um, hard to, too hard to, you know. Um, Q 
kill the guy there's too many guys in such a short time and it's already 12 so two hours went that quick so yeah we might just have to call it a day then and and then go reset the tide so yeah we might as well do a spot of looting then loot what we can I don't know how he detected us from that far but yeah it kind of it goes to show really Come on. Yeah, definitely a struggle with the gun now. It is harder than I expected it to be to aim. But that's another guy taking out, so we might as well do a spot of looting now. We're 25, but, you know, we can get as heavy as we like to, I guess. Might as well, since we we came here now, and there's no shard. And we've, you know, we've cleared out the start of the city anyway, let's say. Guess we're taking that seeker. Put him down. There he drops, sack of potato style, to the powerful round, off the Mosin. Okay, I think we're good to start looting. Okay, there's nothing, completely nothing here, nothing's like respawned. I think they just like gave us the same stuff. So literally, yeah, nothing. There's like nothing here. M9 mag again. Brilliant. Could always use an M9 mag, I guess. If we do switch to the M9. Or, you know, if we collect loads of ammo for the M9, we could end up using it, I guess. So, it's still, it's got its use, definitely. Oh, yeah, and I want to go check out that place. Where, you know, the, the new place, that. The hidden place in the fog. So, let's um do that after this, I guess. Let's go check it out. And then we'll probably loot on the way the way the way out. Just just probably these houses that we're loot anyway. Just just so just, you know, we're trying to avoid that place with the AK guys and the the M4, M I don't know if it's a machine gun, but and the commando. Whatever spawns there, I guess. Okay, let's turn the light off. Okay, here it is. It's just there. Okay. There he is. Just heard that, um, really armoured guy. And I know he's definitely armed. I've, you know, with the, from that voice. They have, like, a different voice from the policeman. No way. Okay. Yes! It leads us back to the base. So now we ain't got to walk through. We don't have to walk back through that place anymore. Okay, that's awesome. That means like when we get when we get heavy again, we can just kind of quickly get to base. I just checked that it's definitely our base, and you know with all our stuff in it, and not a second base. Okay, it's definitely our base, I guess. So yeah, that's brilliant. Yeah, so let's go back out there and let's just loot up. I'm trying to think if we should drop anything. We've got a shard now, I guess. Easy sell. And the M9 mug. 
I might as well drop down. And I'll drop one of these down as well. So I wonder where the other one leads to. I think there was one on the other, other side as well. So where was it? Was it outside there? And there's one on each side, so we just gotta find this this oh that's awesome. Can we I wonder if we can just follow it? Yeah, I think it needs like the the light coming out of it. For it to be a path. We could try and follow it, I guess. If it's gonna doesn't seem to be going anywhere. Okay. And let's just go go loot the city quick or what you know what we the you know the easy easy to loot places for now I mean maybe it's a good idea to kill that thingy off and then we can expand the loot and range I guess but they are absolutely terrifying Okay, I'm not seeing him or hearing him. Guess we'll turn the light off now. Oh! And he's so close. We're four back. Oh, is that him? No. He's literally, I think, well, where I heard it coming from was literally behind that um, blue fence. And it sounded a bit more than a policeman. Okay, we go behind the car, I guess. See if we can get a shot from here. Oh, there's a policeman. That'd be the sh shot of the sentry. Okay, to be honest, I don't think we're better to hit him from, you know, with that little angle. Also looking for that other guy. He sounds real close. Might be behind them. Behind the two toilet, porter, cabin things, toilets things. Yeah, I guess let's just um might have to just get on with it then. You know, go um go just go to Colcos and try and get it done. I guess we're gonna have definitely a lot of guys to take out, and we got no silencer. I don't know what the BM the tank's gonna say about it. You know, no no silencer mosing in its territory. Okay, let's um we can head out this way, can't we actually?
Let's go sleep and reset the tide, I guess. And let's hope that mission stays. Really good if that mission stays. Um, how long do we have to sleep for? 14 hours. Um, so yeah, about till zero, I guess. And then... Okay, we shot a shot from the Mosin. It's a bit awkward the way it pulls out um, it pulls out an ammo, so you gotta pull out an ammo to load an ammo to load a bullet. So that's kinda a bit of a I guess a design feature if anything of the Mosin itself. Interesting I guess. But yeah, let's um go sleep. And then we might need to you know, get the radius treasures. So let's go sleep to, you know, let's just sleep till then. And let's hope the mission don't quit. So, the zone ain't came in yet, but we must be very close. And we're five hours away. So let's sleep for six hours. Okay, here we are. Our gun's absolutely glowing with, with ghost ectoplasm. Or something. I don't know what it is, but yeah, it's glowing. I'm guessing that's where we sprayed it. It's gone cold. The ice, the ice has gave it a camo. <laughs> it's got a camo now. But yeah. Okay. And let's go eat up. And then we're gonna probably need um. We're gonna probably need um. You know, a bit more food. Okay, let's um, we we'll go bring two food with us, and we got three days on the clock, so out there as quick as we can, and let's go get some radius treasures, and then try and get that silencer, I guess. It looks a bit different now. The colours are a bit different. I don't know if it's just a headset, but or a slight bug. But yeah, let's um, sell that. That shard's worth a bit more. I thought it was worth 150 each. But it seems to be worth a little bit more. Okay. Maybe we could sell some stuff as well. Make up for... So we don't need the MP MP5 mag. We need that. M4 mag. I don't really think we're going to get an M4 since we've already... Uh, it's only worth... It's not worth... It's worth next to nothing. So we might keep the M4 mic. I'm sure we got three Berettas, haven't we? So we got that other pistol. Two, and there's our pistol then. I might have to sell a Beretta then. Since we've got three. We should have three anyway. Okay, worth a bit. Okay, worth, you know, a little bit. I don't know why it's saying three, three to eight though. That's interesting. Yeah, it only gave us a hundred, but it says three, three hundred. Um, we'd need some more food. And I guess there's not really much else to sell, really. Everything else we kind of need. Maybe we could sell that ammo. But I don't really think we get too much for it. And we might be able to switch it out for when we get low, I guess, on rounds. Yeah, let's um go. Go and get some radius treasure then. Um... Do this as quick as we can and try and get that scope, that um, silencer for it. But it definitely take how oh, we take it on the way back. It's got the ammo. We use the ammo for the pistol, don't we? So 
you know, it might be worth getting that. And we got a spider. There it is. See if we can snipe it before it becomes a problem. Okay, I don't think I think it's stuck. So I don't think we have to worry about that one. Looks a bit stuck. Okay. It, it's unstuck itself, it looks like. See if we can take out both of these fragments. Okay, he's moving out the way. Look at him. Look at him move. Damn. Ouch. So we definitely dropped around, but we should be okay. Yeah, I'm not sure what to use it there. The bullets are actually cheaper for the, the Mosin or thingy. But yeah, maybe we should have brought the pistol for this. But yeah, we're not going to be out for long, I guess. And it's good practice, I guess, for the Mosin. Whole slurry of things, I guess. Spider down there. Not sure if we loaded or not. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it takes about one bullet each. Didn't notice how we went through five shots there. Okay, five shots again. Okay, let's head off. I think it's down here, the spider, as I can hear it. Okay, I hear it. It's got to be just over this hill, maybe. No, it definitely sounded close, though. Okay, we got a fragment down there. Okay, there it is. There's a little spider friend. See if you can get the sneak on it. But you know what spiders are like? They always know where the explorer is. But they like to sniff out the explorer. Okay, ghost up there. Try to speed things up. It would be nice to have the pistol. You know, to reduce ammo waste, I guess. But we're here now, I guess.
Okay, I'll be extra extra careful in this bit. It's very easy to fall. Okay, another polygonal. The only problem with a polygonal, we've got enough of them. We need straight cash. Maybe we could sell it. I think they're worth a bit more. I think they're worth like 300 each. Each. But you know what they can be worth? A few stims, like three stims per one. Okay, just have to one tap him. Yeah, oh, yeah, let's see if that mission, let's get that mission done as quick as we can. Oh, we got no missions here, it must have ended. The broken shard one, yeah, it ended, damn. So yeah, it definitely clears after one mission, so it's all about running around. I guess to different maps is the final thing I can say about that. And getting it all done in one thing here. And it, you know, it don't even, it don't show you where it's going to be. You just got to know instinctively, I guess. And a box over there. Okay, T2. Easy sell, I guess. I know you can definitely find them weather monitors here. So you know it might be worth a search, but we definitely we don't want to spend too much time out here. Because we've still got um We still got coal cars to get in this this wipe hopefully. So we need to do this as quick as possible. Um I was just thinking if we decide to go without without a silencer. I don't know if it'd be suicidal to be honest, but yeah, we might as well make this a, a loot one because we do need the money for, you know, without a silencer, they're just going to hear us from everywhere. And then we'll run off the Balotaki, I guess, and get there. Radius treasure. Might as well clear him out while we're here. Oh, and he just disappears as soon as we're in position. Okay, looks like he's gone. Could be a shard there, maybe. Maybe we could quickly walk past and see if we hear a shard on the backside. Okay, there is there is a shard here. He's coming back right now. Okay, behind us. Don't normally get monsters out here. Okay, he saw us. Okay, 
I'm guessing he's gonna come. I think he's he's probably just like hugging the wall or something but I definitely heard buzzing down here so we might as well clear it out and get the shard and hopefully we get another broken shard we can get a mission done in one if if they don't delete the shards as you collect them I guess oh he's here here he comes Brilliant. Is there a box down there? I guess. No, no box. I think I'm already going to slap. Yeah, I'm already full. Shows you how little you can carry with, you know, with your two guns. So let's, um,. Throw something out, I guess, for a start. Or maybe, I don't know. I was gonna say head back and sell the loot and, and then try and get the scope. The, the silencer, I mean. Trying to look up there if there's a, another. Nope, there's no thingy up there, but it might be inside the... Ah, uh, there's the radius treasure here as well, that we might as well get. Okay, we're... Underloaded now. Drop things to the way out. check down here for you know because the weather monitor spawn I guess or can okay just a flashlight nothing good this time let's head out to that artifact I'm already heavy again. Yep, yeah, already heavy again. So yeah, artifacts weigh quite a lot. Seem like z like 0 0.2 to 2 kg. It seems like with the bigger ones. I just heard like a commando kind of noise just then. That might be a commando. But yeah, the way back now, I guess. Couldn't carry much because we brought too much stuff out. But. <sighs> Just get my gun out because I, I thought I, I could hear something crouching around. Okay, there's a the stuff. And we'll just play a tape on the way back. Is there a box down there? 
Okay, it doesn't look like there is. Yeah, we might have to look look into taking other missions and making a bit more money as well. That's another thing before we go to Kalkas. We don't we haven't been looking into much missions lately, as I guess. You know of what we could you know like clear out missions and stuff that we could probably do. UNPSC, Explorer 12, Log 10-9, Web Anomaly. Webs are long, dark strands of material that are most commonly found in forests, but have been documented attached to other vertical structures. They are totally silent and completely deadly, making webs a particular threat to explorers who prefer to traverse during evenings and in low-light environments. After coming into contact with a web, you will immediately start to feel a burning pain that will not subside for some time after contact. In the early days, explorers thought that spawns were the cause of webs. I was part of the team sent out to take samples and help determine if this was the case or not. I didn't observe any spawns creating web anomalies, nor did we observe any spawns climbing or nesting near the webs. Our research team concluded that web anomalies are self-fabricating, in line with the UMPSC's theories on emergent anomalous phenomena. Yeah, he was talking about the web, web, um, the tent, um, the black tentacles, I guess. They're called web anomalies. So yeah, um, I guess that's a bit more information on the web anomalies. He talked about, you know, the spawns, the spawns kind of, I, I think he, I don't, I can't remember he said there was the ones, the, the thought it was the spawns, the spiders doing it, he said. But, and then he said something about bringing out a team. I guess as well. That I analyzed it. I missed the conclusion though. Uh, you know what he said about. Okay, let's just grab this ammo. Might as well have a bit more 18 ammo. Might as well take it all to be honest. Attention! Just this is UNPSC emergency use. guidance recording L1 61. If you are listening to this, you are most likely suffering from one or more of the following conditions. I really love the way we can like get into Blotticky Village now. We gotta find how to, you know, how to use it to get into other places, I guess. Maybe there's like another a trail that you can find. You have to find the the where it where it is to find it back at base. And then you just follow it back to base, I guess. Then we'll have like another place to wherever it takes us, I don't know, but... But yeah, let's um... sell this stuff and see if we got enough money for the... the, the silent... the suppressor. And let's see if that shard's gone. Okay, I think the shard's gone. So you can't just keep collecting them all. That really... I don't know. Yeah, I guess... You know, you can't just collect them up. And keep... And use them on different missions. And I'm guessing we lost the helix as well. We had a helix. So yeah, that's quite sad to see. That we lost two, two items. And we'll save the bookshot. And the pistol ammos. Okay, so we made a little bit. Try and get this um, gun upgraded. And the silencer. So I'm pretty sure it's this that we need. So is it? Let's see what it's called. D DTK. Yeah, maybe it just goes on without without a, a adapter. Maybe I don't know. Well, we we'll just have to see. I guess. 
and it just goes straight on. Okay, definitely needs that. May need that adapter. I mean, worth a try, I guess. Um, so yeah, let's just hope it's the adapter then that it needs. Don't know what we're adding, but let's just hope it's that. There we go. Perfect. No more land shots. I think it decreases damage though. Let's check. Check if it decreases damage. I don't think it does. Yeah, I wonder about the armor piercing rounds. Does it is it giving me a lot more damage than just the normal rounds? I don't know, it's hard to explain what I'm trying to talk about though, but you know, the normal rounds gave me almost full penetration. And then the, a the AP rounds gave me full. But, you know, it was only like 10% more. So I don't know if we're paying extra for that. Just 10% more damage or armor piercing. So I don't know. Maybe that's a interesting thing that... You know, might be worth checking into, I guess. Or if we learn about it. But, um, polygonal... Um, this, I guess we'll take. And then we've got everything to do the mission. And how many days have we got left? So we've got enough, we've got enough time to, to do it. I guess as well. For next time. This is the end of episode 13. Boys, the most amazing. And there'll be more next week.